How do you grow your business with informed decisions? Budget templates are a powerful tool to manage spending habits and take more control of your money. Our budget template collection provides customizable resource slides that you can download and customize for any business need. It includes slides for quarterly and monthly budget tables, budget summaries, budget versus actual, budget breakdown, CNP chart, plus many more. Let's review how these tools work and how each one will streamline the budgeting process and help you manage funds efficiently. Budgets are extremely important to make sure a business stays on track financially, whether it's an established company or even a new startup. Budget plans are also highly valued by investors when they decide whether to fund a company or not, because it shows predicted performance and reveals priorities based on those predictions. Companies always draw up a budget before they start any type of financial reporting period, usually a fiscal or calendar year. It helps make sure that all the decision makers in an organization are aligned on priorities. A budget table is a great way to visualize spending over a reporting period. It will make sure you're not overspending in any particular category. As of 2022, marketing budgets make up 10% of companies' overall budgets on average. In this example, we see the different categories that make up a marketing budget. These will be unique to every company. First, identify various expenses and list them out by category, such as social media, video advertising, or email marketing. Then, add any new marketing strategies to the list that you want to implement during the period. Assign a budget amount to all of these categories. In a perfect world, a budget amount would be 100% accurate, but that's not usually the case, because budgets are forward-looking and static, while real life is full of unforeseen variables. A budget table measures the ideal financial numbers against the actual figures. The static budget amount represents the best case scenario that companies can use to plan expenses and revenues. As the financial period progresses, whether it's a month or a quarter, look at how the actual data compares with what was assumed in the forecast. Budget tables show the difference between the static proposed budget and the actual figures to analyze the magnitude of those differences and explore why they happened. Use a budget summary to quickly identify where the differences between the proposed and actual spending are greatest, and which spending categories should be flagged. For example, if the budget table shows the promotion expenses are over budget, it will flag them visually. At the bottom, the percentage of the budget reached is shown. The best budgets are collaborative, take input from all managers across an organization, and most importantly, are flexible and open to adjustment. A waterfall chart helps understand the total impact of the difference between the budget and the actual spending, which is also known as variance analysis. It is a very useful way to present results in an orderly way and highlight deviations. That focus on the variance is what sets waterfall charts apart from normal bar charts. The columns can be color-coded so users can easily distinguish between priority or risk levels for each category. So far, we've seen how budgets can be represented by time period, but they can also focus on specific categories inside the overall budget. This example is useful for the marketing department to see which tasks have the highest budget and, therefore, which are the most important. Then, priorities can be reshifted if necessary. An alternate chart provides a more detailed view, with subtasks listed below each category. And last but not least, a sand key chart provides a bird's eye view of significant changes to a budget over time and across categories. It's a useful tool to calculate revenue and better plan your budget. All right, so let's take a look at how Netflix might use it. The left side shows the total revenue across two categories. In this case, streaming and DVD. Both of these flow into the total revenue. As it goes to the right, the chart divides the total revenue into the costs and the gross profit. Netflix could then see how much money is needed in each category on the right side to generate a certain level of revenue on the left side. For instance, how many subscribers it needs to generate enough revenue to earn an operating profit after all of its content, marketing, and technology expenses. When done right, budgeting can be a clean, repeatable process that's done monthly. Use these templates to review previous periods and improve budget accuracy into the future. If a company is just starting out, budget templates can be an effective path towards sustainable growth, as long as they are done on a consistent basis.
Calculate existing revenue, scrutinize cash flow, communicate your funding clearly, and make better business decisions with these budgeting tools. Now, go check out our video on how to create a business action plan for additional tools and insights on how to plan your budget. Thank you so much for watching.